Hi there, Kevin from Easy ESL Games here, and today we have a great game that'll get your whole class moving and having a ton of fun. It's one of my personal childhood favorites, What Time Is It Mr. Wolf? This is a great game for days when your regular classroom routine is feeling just a little too boring. Here are the details. This game teaches the question, what time is it, and works great as a way to use time vocabulary. There are no materials required and almost no preparation. You will, however, need a large area and a wall that can act as a finish line. The goal of this game is to touch the wall without Mr. Wolf catching you. Here's how to play What Time Is It, Mr. Wolf? Start by choosing a student to be the wolf. For the first game, it's usually more fun if the teacher is the wolf. Have your class line up side by side about 15 to 20 meters away from the wall. Make sure Mr. Wolf covers their eyes and is facing the wall. Have your whole class use the target question at the same time. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Then the wolf can answer with any number from 1 to 12. If the wolf says, it's 6 o'clock, then everyone has to take 6 steps towards the wall. If the wolf says it's three o'clock, then everyone has to take three steps towards the wall. If a student makes it all the way to the wall, then they are safe and Mr. Wolf can't catch them. But if the wolf hears that the class is close enough to catch, when the class uses the target question, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? The wolf can answer, dinner time. Once the wolf yells, dinner time, he or she turns around and runs as fast as they can trying to catch one of their classmates before everyone touches the wall where they are safe. Whoever the wolf catches becomes the wolf for the next round of the game. Every time I've used What Time Is It Mr. Wolf in my class, it's been a ton of fun. It's a great break from your usual classroom routine, and it's a great way to teach and reinforce time vocabulary. Here's a teaching tip. With younger students, it helps to remove the words Mr. Wolf and replace it with a child's name. For example, what time is it, Lisa? This makes the question much more natural and effective. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? A great way to review time-related vocabulary. There's no materials required, and it's a ton of fun. If you've liked this game or any of our other videos and resources, please take a second to like, share, follow, or subscribe to Easy ESL Games. And if you have any questions about how you can apply this in your classroom, leave the question for us in the comments section. We'll get back to you right away. Thanks. That was easy.